There have been a lot of debates over whether Node.js or Bun is better. Here we'll discuss some comparisons between these two that will lead us to the final conclusion. First off, you have to know that Bun and Node.js are both JavaScript runtimes. And you may ask, What the heck is a JavaScript runtime? In a nutshell, a JavaScript runtime is an environment where JavaScript code is executed, like web browsers for example. But unlike browsers, Bun and Node.js execute JavaScript code on the server side. Node.js was released in 2009 as an asynchronous event-driven JavaScript runtime that is designed to build scalable network applications. Bun was released in 2021 as a drop-in replacement for Node.js, built from scratch using the Zig programming language. In terms of performance, Bun claims to be fast than both Dino and Node.js. On their website, they have some graphs that show a performance comparison showing HTTP requests per second, messages sent per second, and average queries per second across Bun, Dino, and Node.js, which really shows that Bun has a better performance and speed. And in terms of CPU and memory usage, you can see in this graph, which is from another benchmark, that Bun has less CPU usage than Node.js, contrary to the memory usage where this graph shows us that Node.js has less memory usage than Bun. But remember that CPU and memory usage varies by the type of project, but some benchmarks suggest that Bun can be more efficient than Node.js. In terms of compatibility, Bun aims to be a drop-in replacement for Node.js, where it natively implements hundreds of Node.js modules and web APIs, including FS, Path, Buffer, and more. And in terms of package management, Node.js uses NPM or Yarn to install and manage packages. While Bun has its own package manager that is NPM compatible, meaning it can install and manage packages from the NPM registry, and it's designed to be faster as this graph shows. All that sounds cool, but my favorite feature is that Bun has a built-in TypeScript support. In terms of size and dependencies, Node.js has a large codebase with a lot of dependencies, contrary to Bun that is a lightweight runtime with a smaller codebase and minimal dependencies. It features integrated tools like a transpiler and bundler to reduce the dependency on third parties. In terms of community and ecosystem, Node.js has a large and bigger community and ecosystem with a huge number of third-party packages, while Bun, which is relatively newer, has a smaller community and ecosystem compared to Node.js. So after extensive research and numerous discussions, after analyzing the data from every angle, after countless debates and re-evaluations, after much contemplation and reflection, after thorough deliberation and consideration, after reviewing all the evidence and conducting further experiments, the final conclusion for the best JavaScript runtime is, it doesn't matter. Just choose the hell you want depending on the project or the task. 